The fuel pressure regulator, or more commonly known as the suction control valve, plays a vital role in diesel engines. If a P0089 was to set, what should we check for? And what are the steps required to resolve the problem? G'day, I'm Zach, welcome to Automate. Put simply, this valve works in a closed loop system with the fuel rail pressure sensor, ECM and injectors. There are several different common rail pumps used by OEMs. Some may use multiple suction control valves to adjust fuel delivery for each pumping chamber, but their operation is still the same. The suction control valve relies on feedback from the rail pressure sensor in order to supply the correct amount of fuel, keeping the rail at its working pressure. The suction control valve regulates the amount of fuel entering the pumping chambers to meet all engine load conditions. The valve receives a duty cycle control from the ECM in order to allow more or less fuel into the pumping chambers. The ECM monitors the fuel rail pressure sensor to determine if the commanded and actual pressure are within a predetermined range. If they fall outside the desired parameters for a predetermined time, a P0089 signal performance or high fuel pressure code may set. This may even render the vehicle into a reduced power mode. Like what you see? To gain access to the most advanced automotive technical training available, visit our website and become the best technician you can be.